we played um, three straight weekends on the road and um, haven't had a chance to play at home yet, so um, probably getting a little bit road weary. Uh, but I thought the guys played really well um, for the most part. We, have, we still have a lot of work to do. We're, we're a long ways away from where we want to be, but um, I think our tendencies are in the right direction. The guys are improving in the areas that we're, we're concentrating on. Doing the draw, back to the point, shot, save, rebound, scores! There it is! Shot from the point, and the Huskies bang in the rebound. Gavin Gould gets his second of the season. On a Friday, I think our, our speed, I think we, we use, utilize our speed well. We use support ice well. Um, we're opportunistic in some ways. Um, so I think that uh, our transition game was probably a difference in that game. Way there by Seamus Donahue, and the Huskies start it back. Here comes Ranky across the line. He's got a guy leading up. Right, Meyer will shoot. Scores! I don't remember how I got the puck in the neutral zone, but um, I just saw some ice, so I took it. And uh, I saw there's four of their guys back, and I didn't really have anyone with me, so I just tried to delay and, and see what uh, would come. And I saw Grayson come down the right side, so I just tried to get it to him, and he put a, put a good shot on and. It went in for him, so. Yeah, well, uh, there was a bit of a turnover in the neutral zone, and uh, Mitch Ranke grabbed it and was starting to drive up the middle, and I actually just hopped off the bench on a line change, and I was coming up the right side, and I, I saw that there was a bit of an opening there, and uh, he just made an unbelievable pass over to me. He kind of delayed a little bit and opened up some room for me, and, and I just tried to get the shot off quick and get it on net, and luckily it uh, snuck through the goalie there. Lake Superior is a, a good hockey team. They're well coached. They battled hard. They competed. They they won battles. They began to get some some time in our zone, which which gave us a little trouble. And really, what it is, it fatigued some individuals out because they couldn't get off the ice. And and that was a big deal on uh, on Saturday night. Um, I thought we still played. Obviously, we still played well. And our skill players, you know, were able to get some things done. The, a big thing was our penalty kill and in, in in some some just minor tweaks and and more attention to detail on Saturday night. Um, two five on threes, extended five on threes. I believe each of them were more than a minute and a half. Um, so they were, they were extended five on threes. You know, you kill off part of it, then you have to kill off the rest of it. And I give our guys a ton of credit. I give Packy a ton of credit for for grinding it out and and, uh, and doing a good job. Yeah, I'm, I've been playing with uh, Jake Jackson and uh, Brent Baltus usually, and uh, also with Marcus Russell a bit. And, um, but yeah, playing with Jake Jackson, I mean, he's got so much speed, so it's so nice playing with him. And we've had some success on the forward check, you know, turning over pucks and creating some offense that way. And, and uh, yeah, I think we've had some good success so far. He's got a great brain. He's got a really good stick. He's got a high compete level um, and, and everything else. The, the things that he that he lacks a little bit, he can work on. And, and a lot of that will just be helped in, in some good weight room sessions and some good time with Tyler Shalas. So Grayson's doing a fantastic job for us. Um, he's given us great depth down the middle, and uh, he's going to be a player. He has a, he has a real chance to be a, a special player. Battling down there for Lake State. Dangerous play by Gould, but he gets away with it. Walks in. Scores! Oh, what a play by Gavin Gould as he took it right from the blue line and fired a wrister and had eyes right past Ossoff.